Okay, so it's an hour later, and I finally found where the person with my 3D printer was. Time to do the reveal. So, the box is sat over there. And I was quite shocked. Because heavy though it is, probably that big. Which is not very big at all. So, set up the camera and we'll unbox it. Nothing useful on that whatsoever. But I wasn't really expecting anything useful on that bit. Before I get too many complaints about I'm not talking enough, etc, etc, it's not often I do this kind of video, it's just for historical purposes really. So, let's see what we've got in this box. Nice little introduction from Adrian. I'll still start if there's not if there's bits missing, but uh, let's uh, go through. One bag of printed parts. Very nice quality. Very nice quality. to come out like that, I will be happy. Power lead. UK power lead. Clover. Awesome. One of the things I've got on the US the adapters. We've got here, we've got Captain Tape. And the heat wrap. Two-card cable by the looks of it. Uh, a little bit of thin heat wrap. And uh, some kind of ribbon cable for car in the back. Uh, oh, lots of crimpable points. Uh, micro SD and adapter. Do have plenty of those. Um, like that could be, yes, more electronics in there. Oh, looks like they've even put a micro USB cable in there. Yeah, they have. Oh, that's that. Again, not that I don't have many of those. That looks like the hot end parts. You can tell by the heat sink and fan. Lots of brass bits, which is indicative of hot end. Power 
power supply to our volt VC, I'm assuming. 19 volt VC. Nice. And 6.3 amps. So that's a pretty hefty little beast. Some more 3D parts. Oh, some nice tiny little bolts in there. I'm not sure you probably won't be able to see from there. And uh, there's some cable ties in the bottom of there as well. Uh, timing belts, springs. Right, that's cool. Five stepper motors. Again. Big cable ties. Threaded and smooth rods. Another laser cut part. The aluminium part of the heat bed. PCB part of the heat bed. And laser cut part of the 3D. For the hot food bed. And one Arctic white spool of jelly. That's the last thing I'm going to get to use of this lot, of course. But very excited. Now for the build. 